In this set of problems, we'll do some translating before we do any of our adding or subtracting. So we have to correctly um, interpret the English sentence that's given to us and then go ahead and perform the operation. So it says, what is 15.06 increased by 0 0.45? Well, increase means we are adding. So this means we should have 15.06 plus 0 0.45. And so we'll go ahead and set that up vertically. So 6 plus 5 is 11. So carry that 1. 1 plus 0 plus 4 is 5. 5 plus 0 is 5. 1 plus 0 is 1. So we have 15. 0.51 as our answer for this first one. Now it says, what is 87.312 decreased by 9.6? Well, decreased by just means we're subtracting. So we have 87.312 and we're subtracting off 9.6. So again, we'll set that up vertically. Oops, made a little mistake there. So set it up vertically, 87. 0.312 minus 9.6. Again, lining up decimal points in place values. So 2 minus nothing is 2. 1 minus nothing is 1. You can do a little bit of borrowing here. So I'll borrow from the 7. And then my 3 becomes a 13. So 13 minus 6 is 7. So we'll put a 7 there, drop our decimal point straight down. Uh, but again, 6 is smaller than 9, so we'll need to do more borrowing. So we'll borrow 1 from the 8 and make 6 into 16. So 16 minus 9 is 7. And then, of course, 7 minus 0 is 7. So our answer here is 77.712, or 77 and 712 thousandths. And finally, what is 0 0.58 less than 72.19? Well, remember this less than is one of those where in order to take less than something, that something needs to be there first. So 72.19 goes first, and then we're taking away 0 0.58. So we've got 72.19 minus 0 0.58. 9 minus 8 is 1, but then we need to do some borrowing for this, uh, for the tenths digits. So we'll borrow 1 from the 1's place, make that into an 11. So 11 minus 5 is 6. Drop down the decimal point, and then 1 minus 0 is 1, and 7 minus 0 is 7. So our answer here is 71.61, or 71 and 61 hundredths.